Well, here we go. Combat Fight Series at the York Hall. And we head into the main card this evening. Boat number 11, 51 kilos, A-class Muay Thai. Five three-minute rounds. We have Andrea Altaldo from Diathlon Gym. And she faces our very own Alex Rose from JTT Muay Thai. This has the makings of a great fight. Alex the Savage Rose. She's just got this intent in her eyes, which scares me to watch. <laughs> yeah, she also tries to kill you. I know. Imagine James is late home over the boys or something. Oh, you God. wouldn't want to come back to those fights. He'd be eyes, under the elbow, you? not the tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely yeah. team. Lovely team. timing. We joke about that, but she's come on so much for me. She's a real talent. And she's been progressing nicely in all her fights. Lovely left body kick. Very powerful stature. Time team, Altadel coming forward. She looks like she's getting her rhythm already. My only concern is she carries her hands a little bit low for me. And against somebody who's already shown a big overhand right, you don't want to be messing around too much with that. But as you say, she's finding her rhythm and importantly, she's finding her range. Yeah. Nice work there, pushing the head. Looking for that knee to the head, but really she should have just gone knee to the body. Straight away. She had a nice opening there. There again, she's trying to go upstairs to the head. That's better work now. Just get back to the bread and butter. Good body kick. You can see the pace difference here. There's no rush with the work. She takes her points and then she sits, breathes, and is ready for the next exchange. Again, nicely timed tee. She's holding that range beautifully. That jab is sticking out nicely. Ooh. Going high with the teep again. Controlling that clinch. Head tucked in. It really shows how effective a strong jab and teep really is. You can disrupt someone's rhythm trying to come forward. Well, if anyone can tell us that, it's you, my friend. <laughs> Kieran Shanahan, the, the master of that. Gonna see you in action next week. Well, see right a lot now, of teeth going. Rose versus Altadil. Over five threes. Wish oh, I lovely like elbow to the middle. Lovely knee in the middle there, and then locking up the leg for the return, and then firing back with the knee. I love how See, she blocked that knee there. Superb technique, isn't it? Great first round.
for round number two. Here we go, round two. Boy. Yeah, works that team nicely. Sets the position, sets the distance, and then spikes the knee on the way in. Seems to have an answer for everything, Alex Rose. A class, remember, knees and elbows are allowed to the head. Altadil is game. She's coming forwards. Seems like she's trying to hunt for that head kick a little bit more now. Nice control by Rose in the clinch. Lovely knee. She times the knee really well. There's that block a little bit better where the knee is over the hip and the foot's a little bit lower. Means they can't knee over the top. Good technique from Alex Rose. Nice body kick there from Altadil. Single shot though. Needs to work, needs to put more of them in action. Rose again, holding balance. Lovely balance. Beautiful work. Just waiting for the counter, Rose. She's waiting for Altadil to make her move and then she's firing her shots. Nice teeth, but just smothered it a little bit. Nice, turning back kick. Altadil needs to do something here. She's almost like she's run out of ideas. Comes with the hands, but... Great score. She's got to change the game up a little bit for me. It's all on Rose's terms, she's just playing. Nice team. She's so calm, she has that slight pause before she throws something, and that's how you know how sure she is she's gonna land the shot. Yes. Great composure. Looks like she likes to work on the counter, taking the back, you know, watch for the knee to the head. Good knee. Lovely tee. Yeah, she's working really well at controlling the distance with that tee. That's much better knees there from Altadil. She's now putting some venom into her shots. But Alex is holding position, twisting her to the side. Round three. Well, here we go, round three. Alex Rose in the white gloves. Andrea Altadil in the black gloves. Red shorts. Again, teeth to the face. Alex just utilizing that range beautifully. Elbows raining, strong knees in the clinch, body kicking on the way out. Kind of feel like she's having it all her own way at the moment, Alex Rose. Again, good push kicks. Just setting her position, evades the counter. 
Look at that. It, that awareness of range. Alex Rose only had a handful of fights. You would not think it, would you? No, no. Fighting A class and putting on a performance like this. She looks so comfortable and fluid yeah. with her movement and so sure. It's something that normally only comes with experience, but she's in there looking like a seasoned pro. James Toomey building up uh, quite a stable of fighters now. He's obviously doing something right at the gym. Credit to him. Lovely balance. We've got Michael Wakelin coming up later on. The return of. That'll be fantastic. David Mah Maida as well. Fighting for him. Got some real treats on offer here tonight at Combat Fight Series. Live at the York Hall. Oi! Teep to the face! No leverage on that elbow there from Altadil. Entering the last minute of the fight. No, not the fight, sorry, the round. <laughs> Getting overexcited here. Round three. to see if Alex Rose has got another gear to step up and see if she can take her out. Yeah, right now it's just like she's got into autopilot with her distance and she kind of just reacts yeah. nice and safely, which is not a problem. It's It'll be nice to see her step up a little bit with elbows maybe and start taking the fight further. True. It's great controlling it. It's great showing that composure. She's also in, a f in fantastic condition. Both ladies are in fantastic condition, but the Thank abs you. are popping out. Alex Rose's abdominal muscles Killing us all, aren't they? Oh, God. <laughs> wow. Another round. brilliant round. Oh, she is comfy in there. Four. Here we go, round four. See a slight bit of swelling. Yeah, on I just the noticed side. that. Oh, she just ate Alex Rose's foot. Big teep to the face. Oh, uh, there's, there's blood. blood coming now. I think she's opened her up. Oh, she's got yeah, her nose. It's her Fuck. nose. Look. Her nose is broke. Her nose is a nice little dent in her nose got there. Well, cover your drinks. Yeah, I wonder if that's a broken nose. She's got a welt on the right side of her forehead, but her nose is just absolutely spewing blood right now. I was just about to say, I love the way Alex controls the fight, but I'd love to see if she can step up a gear and now put her away, because I feel like she's that little step level above. And she's answering the question. Andrea still staying tough in there, but she needs to start putting out something more now because she's not causing Alex any problems really at the minute. Yeah, she's not breathing through that nose very effectively. No. That looks like she might have broken it. Look. No, her mouth is wide open. Ooh, oh, right on the got nose. Kicked square in that smashed nose.
Alex just knee into the head there. Using that hand to her advantage, putting it right in her face. Blood spraying out Look everywhere. at a smile on her face. She Al wants Seville it then. Not taking a step back though. Fair play to her. She's made a stone. But look at the darkness of that blood. It looks like her nose is broken there to me. And there's a big welt on her right eye now as well. Look. Alex Rose putting in some work now. Altadil is made of stone. Big kudos to her, she's tough. But Alex Rose is still picking her shots and landing hard with them. I'd like to see Rose, rather than do those little knees, step back and really bang a knee in like she did before. Make them count, especially while someone's tired, breathing heavily through a broken nose. Big knees to the body are going to take out of you. Oh, knee to the face. Oh, that is not very tasty. I do not envy Altadil being in there. Feeling those shots on her face now. Oh. Wow, what a round four for Alex Rose. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the fifth and final round. Here we go, fifth and final round now. So for me, Altadil needs a knockout to win. Alex Rose has coasted nicely on points, shown some great skills and a great array of technique as well. Every punch landed on that nose has got to hurt. Mouth is wide open, you can't breathe through that broken nose. Especially with the deadly push kicks that she has to the face as well. Yeah. Beautiful work there, got a kick caught but brought it out. See her nose is actually slightly over to the right side there. That right hand of Rose has obviously had effect. Rose just getting behind the jab, stepping in with that elbow. These are where she's knee to the head nicely, she's got to be careful. Kicking from Rose. Just sitting, picking the points. One, two, down the middle. Power shots. What I like is it's simple stuff done well. That for me is what wins fights. Even just the little step backs that she's doing there. You know, going into Southpaw, going back to Orthodox and then mixing her shots then. I was going to say, locking that right arm of Altadil down. It gives the option for the left elbow for Rose, and she took it. Just didn't cut across enough for me. So it came off the side of her head. 
Beautiful teeps. I really like her push kicks. There you go. She times them to perfection. They, you know what it's like. They just take the wind out of you, take you off your step, take your balance off. Nice work there in the clinch. Altadil slowing. See her nose is sitting on the right side of her face a little bit there. Yeah. Yup. I must say though, Altadil, absolute warrior. Yeah, she's tough, man. Still coming forward. I mean, she has not fallen once. She has always come back forward, which is admirable. However, Alex Rose is just completely running the pace now and making it very apparent that this is her fight. There you go. On the bell. Wow, what a fight. Well done, ladies. Take a bow. for these warriors come on and after five epic rounds of Muay Thai action we go to the ringside judges where our judges have reached the unanimous decision ladies and gentlemen your winner in the white corner Alex Rose And your fantastic runner-up, Andrea Altadil.